Okay, let's do it. I know this can be done. I've done it on my practice round and I've seen videos of it done. So I just have to get lucky. Just like the carry fight. It took me a few times there as well. Okay, he cast ink the first round. That's just the way I like it. Although I'd rather he let me go first. Okay, this is layer number three. And he goes first again. Why would you do that? You're not allowed to go first. Silly Kraken. Ink, yep, yeah, keep doing that. Okay, I think that's layer number four. So I think we're good. Is four layers enough? Let's see. Well, he missed, so that's a good sign. It's, worth, it's, it's well worth using that turn for fast. Using a turn for fast, because, okay, 134 damage. And he's casting ink. That's what I like to see. He missed, I'd like to see that as well. It's always good. I need to do more damage than that. 59. But at least he's missing, so I can't complain. 26. Not bad. 64 for a critical. That doesn't seem like much. Just keep on missing. Or if you want to use ink, go ahead. I mean, I'm okay with that. Letting mo oh, I got to go first. That's nice. That's nice. Ow. What's up with that? I was doing so well, too. I was doing so well. <sighs> That's annoying. So close, yet so far. Let's try this again. Maybe I should do it five times. I forget how many that is. I think this is three now. Although it's not gonna matter at this point. Look at my health. I guess we can keep trying. Four. This would be four layers, I think. So this is where I was last time after four casts. This is five. Which is one more than I did last time. But now I have to use a turn for fast. So now he's gonna kill me. Maybe not. I like that. They use the sound effect as if he actually hit me when he misses. Okay, now we just beat him down and hopefully not die. Ooh, 308 on a critical. Yeah, that was 308 damage. I'm pretty sure. Oh, 125. Damn it. Oh, so, so, so close every time. So close. Keep try, keep try. My luck will improve. Ink twice in a row. That's, there we go. You know what, I'm just gonna make a save state here because I feel like me a cheap douche. So that way I can just reload there every time. Cause you know, that's basically where we wanna get to. You don't wanna get to, you know, him not killing you in the first two rounds. And that's two rounds of him casting ink, so that's pretty good. It's cheap, I know, what can I say? It'll just save me doing it 20 times until it works perfectly. Whatever. Okay, that's like five or six layers in Viz, Viz now, at least, so I think I'm safe. Okay, time for some attacks. 100? He has 800 hit points, by the way. 800. Okay, 150. That's another 50, so about 200 so far. It's an, ooh, 170. So almost 400. Okay. Less than 500. It's another 70. Another 27. So close to 600 now. Around 600 for sure. Oh, it looks like I don't need the save point that I made mid-battle. So, pretend I didn't do that. It doesn't exist. Because, okay, so once you get up to about five or six levels of invis, he's missing every single time. He's missing on every attack. I'm going to slow it down again. Oh, never mind. I didn't, pretend I didn't say that. He's not missing on every attack, because he just hit me for 100 damage. 
He misses on almost every attack. I don't think he could possibly ever get it to where he messes every single time. But yay, I win. <laughs> that was close. Could very well have happened that that hit had killed me. But awesome. I rule. Oops. Okay. Time to go get Tiamat. Okay, Kraken was an epic win. And now this is where we left off in Tiamat's area, the Sky Castle. To the right is where I got the Pro Cape. And we are here again to run away. Oh, also, you'll notice I leveled up to 33. I went to the ice, ice cave and fought the eye a bunch of times. It was really fast. Um, basically, Tiamat, I'm going to fight with exactly the same strategy as I did with um, Kraken. Just invis a whole bunch and fast and hopefully not die. So, I figured that getting levels would up my odds a bit. Even though it's probably possible to do them at level 20. I mean, if you get lucky enough. Again, I get poisoned. I guess, in this version of the game, the ribbon doesn't protect against every single status ailment. Oh well. Important thing is that instant death spells don't work. Now here, it's possible to run into the Warmack. Very rare, but it's possible. One of those ultimate boss battle games, it's as hard or debatably harder than the final boss. Most Final Fantasy games have that now, that ultra rare, ultra deadly enemy, and holy, what the... I didn't even see what killed me there. Did you see what killed me? I wasn't paying attention. I, I really wasn't paying attention at all. Was it just getting beat down or what? Oh, I don't know. Maybe they had some instant death spell that got through my armor. I don't even know. Wow, the encounter rate's really high along here. Which makes sense. I mean, it's the final corridor. Hmm, maybe it's meant to be that way. Let's heal, because I don't feel good running around so low. It makes me feel naked. Come on, heal up. Now, Warmack, I don't think he can do without Cure 4. Oh. Shite. This is not good. <laughs> oh well, I guess you're going to see me fail at fighting Warmack. Um, I didn't intend to run into him, for sure, and I'm pretty sure he can't be beat. Um, I saved my game at the end, outside of here, so I don't mind using my save state. Um, I'm gonna die. I'll tell you right now. First of all, I'm almost positive you need the Masamune, the much better sword. And I'm sure you need to be level 50 and have Cure 4. Or at the very, very minimum, have a better sword and cure four. Of course, as a red mage, I can't get the mass immunity and get out of the final area to get back here. So, I'd have to be a red wizard at the least to get the mass immunity. Or mass immune or whatever. Because cure three does almost nothing at this point, if I can even get it off. Okay, 230. So yeah, I'd need to have be level 50, have around 800 to 1000 health. Um... Yeah, that's basically not going to happen in this run at all. Unless I decide maybe to eventually upgrade to a red wizard and get an attempt it. I think I'm going to try that. I'm going to attempt it. Except, again, I think it's impossible without Cure 4. But there you go. Now you know what War Mac looks like. Deadly physical attacks and that spell called nuclear, nuclear. It's pretty darn scary. There you go. Now you know. Whew. I forgot that you were, you are allowed to run away from Warmac. I forgot you were allowed to. But you are, of course. That would be really bad if you couldn't run. Okay. Huh. Okay, so yeah, if you want me to, sure, I'll attempt Warmac later on, level 50. Um, but yeah, let's try Tiamat. We have time for at least one attempt in this video. So let's see how it goes. Fiend of Air. Exactly the same strategy. Only the thunder attack, not much I can do against that. So I'll just have to suffer with it. Um, I think I want at least, oops, not that. At least four of these off, I think. Four invades and then fast. I think that should work, maybe. I don't know. I think he has a thousand hit points, which is more than Kraken. 
So I don't know if this is going to work or not. I seem to be doing over 100 hit points per damage, but he's killing me faster than I'm killing him. Okay, that was just bad luck. Okay, see you in the next video for some more attempts.